Today you will learn how AirPlay works. Subscribe now and let's go. AirPlay is a wireless protocol suite designed by Apple. It enables the device A to send audio or video signals to one or multiple other devices. AirPlay consists of two components, a source and at least one receiver. The source is the device which is able to run AirPlay software, so that it can stream media by using the technology. The receiver on the other hand is a device which is AirPlay compatible and can play the media being streamed. To send and receive streaming audio and video with AirPlay, the devices must be first connected to the same local network. There are two ways to set up AirPlay with such network connections. We could either use Apple's AirPod Express or our home network setup like a router. Apple's AirPod Express is a tiny portable wireless router that interconnects all Apple devices. It does not depend on an internet connection. On the other hand, if you already use a router to share a single internet service among multiple computers in your home, then all you need to do is connect each AirPlay enabled device to the same network. After you've added your AirPlay enabled device to the same network, each AirPlay source can automatically detect all its potential receivers. For example, if you add your iPad to the network, the iTunes app on your iPad will automatically detect the Apple TV in your living room. You may now ask yourself what's the difference between AirPlay and Bluetooth. Well, on the one hand, AirPlay works over a Wi-Fi wireless connection. This requires that all AirPlay devices have to be on the same Wi-Fi network, connected to the same Wi-Fi router. Unfortunately, this means that AirPlay won't work when you are not connected to the local network, unless you have a portable travel router that you can use to create a temporary Wi-Fi network. But because AirPlay uses Wi-Fi, it is capable of a higher quality of streaming audio than Bluetooth. It can also send video, something Bluetooth has not been designed to accommodate for. Bluetooth on the other hand can be used anywhere, as long as you got a media device that is Bluetooth enabled. Bluetooth wireless range is less than Wi-Fi and has a harder time penetrating walls and other obstacles. Last but not least, it is not designed for video transfer, but it does enable more audio features than AirPlay at this time. Thanks for watching this video till the end. If you like this content, please subscribe to my channel to not miss any more videos. See you next time.